uh, but because it's to some extent uh, to do with natural gifts, with physical skills and talents, and there are many, many examples of people who have been very brilliant from a very early age, and they generally keep being brilliant. They don't tend to wear themselves out, if you know what I mean. I have never felt like this, for once and lost for words, your smile has rethroned me. This is not like me at all, I never thought I'd know the kind of love you've shown me. I think this competition is possibly the very best thing that's happened to musicals in years and years. It's very hard for a management to give a starring part to One of the youngest competitors, Laura Michelle Kelly, is only 19, and she's managed to combine the competition with a family holiday. She's already playing a leading role in Whistle Down the Wind. My younger brother, who's 16, played the actual part of Oliver in the Palladium in the West End. He got there first, you see. And then I auditioned for Beauty and the Beast, that's where I got in. My older brother, he's definitely a singer. He'd be in a band or something soon. He's 21, and he's just started doing theatre studies in um, Middlesex University. And uh, Joram's the youngest, he's 13, and he's a real footballer, he likes sport and all those sorts of things, but he's got an amazing voice as well. So I don't understand. I mean, my parents weren't in the business. Well, I think it's just a buzz that's in your blood, really. And it's definitely my blood singing. people that have tried to escape the country that's persecuting them and they escaped to America they've had to go through all of the to the whole huge journey she's finally got there you know, at the beginning of the song she's reliving all the trouble she's gone through reliving all the problems she then cuts in and says well you know we've come this far we're gonna have a good time it's gonna be fine and we're gonna struggle on and it's a story of hope there's one i want someday to see all the children of my children their minds. 
Each of tonight's finalists will go home with £2,000, but the winner will perform on Radio 2's Friday Night is Music Night, a record a CD, and receive £10,000. Well, it's been an incredible evening for all of us. There has to be some winner, one winner. They're all winners in our view, but one winner. Ladies and gentlemen... style, the BBC Radio 2 voice of musical theatre 2000 is Laura Michelle Kelly.